What did we act today? A Galbi's frenzy with Pentheus' bloody ends. Skills not what? The times are dull and all that we receive will hardly satisfy the day's expense. Those that reign in every noble family to claim against us and our amphitheater is quite forsaken. Pleasures of worse natures are gladly entertained. And they that shall us practice in private sports the stews would blush at. To buy diseases from a glorious trumpet, the most censorious of our Roman gentry, esteem an easy purchase. Yet grudge us that with delight join profit and endeavor to build their minds up fair and on the stage decipher to the life what honors wait on good and glorious actions and a shame that treads upon the heels of vice, a salary of six sesterci. For the profit, Paris, and mercenary gain, they are things beneath us. Since while you hold your grace and power with Caesar, we from your bounty find a large supply. Our Nor can one thought of want ever approach us. Our aim is glory, and to leave our names to after times. And would they give us leave, there is all our ambition. We have enemies, and great ones too, I fear. The consul Aretinus sees her spy, set at her table ere a month expired. For being gaught in our last comedy, she would silence us forever. I expect no favour from her. My strong Aventine is that strong Domitian, whom we oft have cheered in his most sullen moods will once return, who can repair with ease the consul's ruins. It is frequent in the city. He hath subdued the Cutty and the Ducky, and ere long the second time will enter Rome in triumph. Jove hasten it. With us? I now believe the consul threats his offers. You are summoned to appear today in Senate, and there to answer which shall be urged against you. I am glad the state is so free from matters of more weight and trouble that it has vacant time to look on us. We obey you. Nay, droop not, fellows. Innocence should be bold. Whate'er our sentence be, think tis in sport, and though condemned, let's hear it without sorrow, as if we were to live again tomorrow. Tis spoken like yourself. 